and Miss Gwen oh, escaped miracle. Yeah. She talks to her vegetables. She really does not know a whole lot about gardening. <laughs> <laughs> but it, I don't know what it is. Everything with her grows. It's she had, she had, so Kat does a um, an art program with the kids every Wednesday from two to four, and every Saturday from ten to twelve. And one of them she does at the uh, Tree Dome Park, and one of them she does here in Curtis Green outside. And the kids do art outside. And she's got a very fun relationship. So they're all kids from the neighborhood. Oh my Please. gosh! Don't. Don't even, it's, it's, we love this place. Yeah. Well, it's nice to have it in one location, too. Well, the other thing is the guys from the neighborhood also, the container was bought with Fisher money, right? But the guys from the, from the neighborhood devised this system. They're all movable brackets where all the tools hang, all organized, everything has got its place. You know, like little bungee cords and hooks down there, and shelves and hooks for that. And I mean, it, everything has its perfect. Uh, so people from the neighborhood come and borrow stuff, and it's very much an honor system. People outside the neighborhood we do, who we don't know will go with them and physically do this. But a lot of the people in the neighborhood, we just hand the key and they come and they sign their tools out and come bring it back, and it's really an honor system. But everybody knows they better keep this place clean because they're going to get it. Me. <laughs> so it'll be uh, half of the garden long and half of the garden wide. And so per season he can slip. It's on a sled. He can slide it back. Wow. And Reed, when will it go in? By, by September. So okay. it needs to be in by early September in order to get the full season extension um, a, a capacity out of it. Gotcha. So that's that's our goal. Three July, August, by September finish, and then we we go on to the more challenging thing. Is, um, how do we plan for it? The reason why market gardening is so important is because when you add this, um, there's a there's a level of sophistication, a level of skill, a level of um, food production that market gardens bring to the neighborhood that um, other gardens like community gardens and family gardens just don't bring. Um, and then when you add season extension onto that, um, you're really able to grow year round. You're able to keep youth busy all year round. You're able to um, participate participate in markets for longer, have more income, put more crops in. Um, and so it's just kind of always so up in, upping the ante. To, to grow up and see how it used to be absolutely nothing but burnt down houses, mm -hmm. abandoned houses, and abandoned fields. And since I was a midget, the grass was like four times my height, so I couldn't even look through it. And it's nice to see how people can come together with an ability like the greening, and they can help and just come and not only but to just mow grass, but we can plant things and we can change the neighborhood. We literally change the whole neighborhood. The way Brightmore works now is totally different than the way it worked two years ago or three years ago or four years ago etc etc because of not only just because of all the gardens but the resources we have now the people we have now the role models we have now like Miss Reed and I tell Hi, you Miss Fisher I just want to tell you that I'm so happy that you're funding for our program and we really really appreciate you thank you hi Mrs. Fisher I just wanted to say thank you very much for giving us the opportunity and the funding to support Brightmore and like hire the kids to do a good job this summer and just in all to say thank you <laughs> hi mrs fisher um i'm hope you're doing it well we often think of you every time we uh, are in this playground and i work with the kids and um we have so many touching moments um and then i think you know that it's so wonderful to have you as a partner that you have such so much patience with us um and that you let us um, develop things our own way and, 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 and you trust us enough um, to be good stewards of your money. So I just want to wish you all the best and thank you. That's great. All right. It's a beautiful day out here, eh? You're playing school. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>